What is up, loud and proud crowd? Hopefully you guys are doing absolutely fantastic. So it was actually 5-9 day today. Not when you see the video, but the day I'm filming this is actually 5-9. So what better day to spend 5-9 than doing some upgrades to the 5-9? So anyways, we're gonna be swapping out the tow mirrors on this truck today because if you take a look over here, tow mirror is not only super loose and just crappy, it goes up and down weird, like it's just like clunky, like really weird. And then also the mirror is busted up here. You can see that's just all, all split apart and broke. The other side's really not bad. It actually doesn't need to replace. Um, I'm not sure if I'm gonna replace it or not. I guess I'm gonna take the new ones out and see if the mirror looks like a different color from fading or something. But like this one's really snug. The mirror doesn't wobble up and down an abnormal amount. And obviously the flip out function works and everything. And there's nothing wrong. It folds in, clicks into place, folds out snaps into place. We're gonna get that replaced. And by the way, when you watch this video, you guys are down to the last 48 hours to enter to win this truck. Yes, win this truck. There's information in the description below. It's a very simple giveaway. You go to the website, link down there, it'll say enter here next to it. Every $15 you spend gets you another automatic entry to win this truck and it could be yours just next week. Well, we did get the new mirror put on this side of the truck because like I said, the mirror on this side was all busted up, broken. It wasn't tight like this one is now to where it's snug and it doesn't have any slop in it. It folds in properly, stays solid, folds out, folds up and down and all that stuff and it, and it works the way it's supposed to. Now, for the other side, we did not change that one out. And I'll tell you why we didn't change that one out. If you look at it from right, right in the center, they're not different colors, they're not all weird and the only difference with this one is from when we had the tires all mudded up and stuff, it slunk some mud up here. So it still needs wash, it's a little bit, a little bit dirty, but it's not different. Um, it's the exact same mirror, same shape, same glass on the back. I mean, everything is the exact same, but we are going to, if you guys want, um, whoever wins this truck can have the other mirror in case they ever want to change it out, but it's really not necessary. That mirror's in perfect shape. Now this one's in perfect shape. The other one we'll show you was just all broken. This mirror was just a mess and that's the reason we changed it out. It was just rough, cracked, didn't sit right, but got that all taken care of. Now keep in mind guys, you have about 48 hours left to enter to win this truck and then it's gone. So make sure you don't procrastinate and miss out on your opportunity to take this truck home. Imagine us sitting in your driveway, seeing this view going down the road I mean, it's just a freaking stud truck. They don't make them like they used to. I mean, this is just like old school, cool, mean, aggressive, six speed manual. I mean, just like if you're a working man or you just like cool trucks, dude, you cannot beat this man or woman. My, my bad. You just can't beat a truck like this. This thing is just a stud. It really is. Every $15, another entry to win. You're running out of time. Now, another thing that I wanted to share with you guys is not in regards to that dually, but my other dually, this truck has had an upgrade done that I think you guys are going to really, really appreciate the way it looks. And we're gonna get to showing you that right now. Yes, we did get tint on the truck finally. And I gotta say, I really like the appearance and it really just tops off the effect this truck can put off when it rolls up. It really looks good. I went with a 5% on the sides, front and rear, and a 5% on the back glass, and then also a 35% on the front. That's what I did. I didn't do a brow, I didn't do anything like that. I just did a 35 and five all the way around the rest. And I really like the look that it does give to the truck. Now, I also did a identical setup on this truck, 35 on the front, five all the way around the rest. And it looks really good. It's a nice balance to where the cab is a lot darker and it really just gives you that privacy, you know? Now let's go inside the truck here. And it really goes with the whole look of this truck being like the jet black interior, the limited trim, the way that that comes, that nice dark effect. It goes good on any truck, don't get me wrong, but it just really 
Um, I think in this trim of a truck and the way this one's set up, it just really has a really good clean look from the inside and the outside. Now in terms of the final touches to the appearance of this truck, there's gonna be a few more things hopefully down the road. Um, hopefully they have some more upgrades for tail lights and stuff like that. I don't mind the headlights on this truck. I wish they were a little darker. I wish they had more of a smoked look, but I honestly don't mind them. They're nice high-end, high-quality light. They're super bright. I mean, like extremely bright on this model um, with the LED stuff that they have going on. Like, I, they're, they're just very functional. They work amazing. Now, I do have wheels and tires I'm picking up actually today, but I'm not going to have time to film that video with you guys today. So push it off for the next video, but guys, I assure you tomorrow in the next video, we are not just going to be like showing you the wheels and tires and not putting them on. We're going to be picking up the wheels and tires for this truck, putting them on the truck and doing the full reveal all in one video. So do not miss tomorrow's upload. It's going to be really freaking good. And then also these wheels and tires on this truck will be for sale. I don't know for sure yet in terms of what I want for them, but they are going to be for sale because I don't need them. This truck hasn't, we haven't done any freaking burnouts on this. They have like 1,500 miles on them. They're an all-terrain tire, and the wheels are not like a clip-on dually wheel like all the trucks used to be, like with an ugly steel wheel underneath with, the, with just a clip-on thing. These are actually a one-piece wheel. They're actually a real wheel. I mean, you know what I'm saying? So it's not like this big part here is just going to clip off and then uh, go flying down the highway like some of those do. This is an actual solid wheel. If somebody's interested in these wheels, hit me up on Instagram in the direct messages or comment under a post over there and say, hey man, I DM'd you about the wheels. Check my message. But anyways, guys, wheels will be for sale. Shoot me some offers and yeah, they could be yours. Thank you guys so much for stopping in. Hopefully you guys like the new not busted up mirror on this truck and also the freaking good looking tint on the fifth gen. Lots of stuff coming to the fifth gen. I mean, performance stuff, some more cosmetic stuff. Um, just a whole a whole bunch of stuff. It's gonna look really really good and then in terms of this truck guys It's gonna be getting shipped off to one of you lucky dogs out there watching this video right now Most people who watch these videos and hear about the giveaways will not enter just keep that in mind It's a very 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 small percentage of people who actually do enter in on these things So for that percentage that entered best of luck you guys have 48 hours left to enter to win this truck and then it's going to be going off to one of you guys. So think about that. Enter while you can. Thank you so much. Leave a fat thumbs up. Comment down below. Subscribe if you're new. Join the team. Join the family. And I will catch you in the next video. Peace.